Hello Niger, I de be now. My name is Ogoro Simon Ogoro and this is now Bantu Page Media. Okay, we de Nam the Azikiro International Airport for here for Abuja and we de go Boruno. When I don't see our results, I'm waiting people being think, waiting people, how people share their mind. How our presidency will be this 2023, last month December. This one, our second round, we want to go do and we de go Boruno State. Boruno people. I they be with the common assignment we hear waiting on our mind be concerning the forthcoming presidential election. Make we stay with for us with the calm. All right, yes, we just arrived Meduguri. This is Meduguri International Airport, and we are here just arriving the place. Let's hear what the people of Borno State have to say as regards to the forthcoming election. This is Bantu Page Media, Simon Ogoro. Let's hear what the people say. Guess what, guys? 2023 with Bantu Page just got reloaded. Yo, what's up, people? My name is Daniel from Bantu Page Media, and you're welcome to, yes, another polling session right here in the year 2023. And just so you know, we are on the road to Kuala State. Yes, we are on the road to Kuala State. We are going by the road, you know. We just can't let you guys miss out the fun, facts, and happenings around the local government in Kuala State. Alongside, at the same time, we are moving on the road. Now we are at Obadjana. This is where Dangote Cement Factory is located. At Obadjana. It's a very big factory, a very, very big factory. You can see how big and massive the industry is. Now this is where it's all located. So stick around guys, don't go nowhere, as I will be feeding you with all the latest and latest happenings around the environment that we might be stopping. My name is Daniel. And don't forget to subscribe and like the video. All right, it's day one in Ilomi. Yesterday was a very, very hectic day as we were moving from Abuja down to Kwara State. Right now, it's day one in Ilomi right now. Let's get to know who the people of Ilomi are going to vote for in the forthcoming presidential election. If it's Tinubu, if it's Peter Obi, if it's Kwon Koso or any other candidates, come with me guys, don't go nowhere, I'll be right back. Hi guys, good morning, it's your girl Chess, as in Chess B, and normally I don't need to talk so much because you all know as the day B. Welcome to Bauchi State, this is Bauchi, we're in the beautiful city of Bauchi State. Let me tell you something, the word Bauchi was originated from this guy he used to be the i mean they call him the first person who settled in bauchi and his name was bahaushe and in hausa when they say you are a bahaushe when they call you a bahaushe it literally means you are a hausa person that's i mean like you're just a hausa person when you're called a bahaushe so this bahaushe guy was the first person to settle in bauchi and then decided to name the state after him so bauchi originated from bahaushe and then bauchi now means this is according to not according from according to chess bio according to early hausa translators they said that the word bauchi means no animal has escaped the traps or arrows of any hunter i mean is that not weird it's so funny because how does that correlate to i don't know but whatever that's how it is so let's just leave it that way so as you can see bauchi is so rocky there's so many rocks around and that's because bauchi is very close to play two states it's just few hours drive and of course y'all know how rocky but um play two states is so no need to go back to that and then also bauchi share guys so quick one Bauchi State, an amazing fact about Bauchi State, Bauchi State spans across two distinctive um, um, vegetation zones we have, right? Which is the Sudan Savanna and the Sahel Savanna. Now, the Sudan Savanna cuts across the southern part of the state. So from the southern region of, region of the state, the, the vegetation is usually richer and then the grasses are shorter. 